Hey. After rushing into marriage with my ex from Morocco and getting hurt so badly, the last thing that I want to do is rush the wedding with Zied. Do you have a few minutes? What? We don't have the money for you to move out. I can't stay with you here in the home. If I go with, uh, in home, your daughter, Tiffany. You can't stay with Tiffany and Micah because they're moving. You have solution for this? No. Yes, my solution, since you always ask me what my solution is, my solution is not to get married before Ramadan. And you would stay with me. That's my solution. You always do that to me. You ask me, okay, what the solution? The solution is what I wanted to do to begin with. Not because get married. everything I tell you, everything we can't, we can't, we can't. What, what we do now? You have given me nothing except for I not have solution. The Ramadan, it's months, the, the people, the, the Muslim, the people, Muslim, it's so close for my God. And you can't do any fault this is month. That's so bad. You can't drink. You can't stay with your girlfriend in one home. You can't, uh, I don't know. So you're a strict Muslim one month out of the year. Uh, really, I won't marry you soon, you know. I won't have being beautiful life. I am here for this, you know. You know, I am traveling here for marry you. Do you understand that it's not that I don't want to marry you? My goal when you got here was to spend as much time with you as possible before we got married. That's the whole purpose of the visa. So don't make me feel guilty because I want th exactly what this is for. I am really trying hard not to make a comparison between Ziad and my ex when it comes to this, but in the back of my head, I'm thinking maybe he's taking advantage of me. But by the same token, I love Ziad. It has taken two years to get to this point. I have to believe that he loves me. And so am I overreacting? 